I got a call from the vet today. You know, it's been almost four weeks since Soleil passed away. And I thought that he, he died of this nasty parrot disease called proventricular dilatation disease, or PDD. But through further investigation of the uh, autopsy, or the necropsy results, from Soleil, it seems as if that wasn't the, the problem. And that's good news because the other birds uh, were, will not have been exposed to this airborne virus called PDD, particular dilatation disease. And once birds get that, it's pretty much just a death sentence. There's no cure for it. But anyway, um, the thing is, is that he died of, of physical injury. He died of hemorrhaging in his brain. He died of, because his, his back or his neck was, was uh, broken. He was uh, suffered some severe trauma. And I don't remember seeing him bump into anything hard. I don't remember anything like that. But he was caught on these wires and they were hanging below where he liked to perch, and uh, he wouldn't let go of them. And I wonder, could it be that some kind of, uh, he, got, he got some kind of a shock that kept him on the wires? Um, and then I went over there, you know, they got him loose, but well, within about 10 seconds. Um, but um, it, just, it just, I wonder if that's what happened. And it's just so damn depressing because it's like I wasn't fast enough, I don't think, to get him off there. And then I, uh, I, I thought I was losing him right there. And I, I massaged his chest and everything. And I brought him back to life. You know, he was, and he, he seemed strong enough to get onto my, to my, I wanted to like prove, well, he's okay, he's okay. And I put him on, on my shoulder. And then he fell off. I had enough time to take a picture of him on my shoulder, but then he fell off. <laughs> fell off right onto the damn floor and just started to cry. A horrible sound. This nasty, nasty, ugly sound. A sound, you know, I'll never forget. And so I'm thinking, was I fast enough? to get him, because a lot of times they'll be grabbing onto something and flap their wings real hard to get some exercise. And I know that people out in the world, they say, oh, but it's a bird, get over it, get over it. Well, I've seen plenty of my share of death, just like a lot of people. And a friend, you get tight with, a, with an animal sometimes, and maybe it's not right you put too much on that animal. But this is an animal that was real magical. That's all I can say. And, you know, the loss is, is hard. But to think that you're part of that loss, directly and partly responsible, I mean, that's really crummy. It's because you just can't bring your, you know, your, your friend back. Or is that some kind of ego thing? And my ego is telling me that because I want to feel sorry for myself and think that I have something to do with his death. But I don't think so. I, I just think that it's the kind of pain that we all have to go through. And if we can hang in there enough time, we'll be okay, you know? It's only when we succumb to that pain and, and, we, and we become totally miserable for weeks and months and years on end that we can't do anything about it. It's beating us then.
I don't think Soleil would want that. And anybody that has that kind of pet and has been through that, that friend, they wouldn't want that for that person to say, okay, I've, I've given up on everything else around me. I, this, this pain just beat me down to the ground whether it be your wife or your girlfriend or your boyfriend or your whatever, or your husband. So I guess that's why I'm doing this video tonight, is to say that I figure, you know, it just makes me a little better, feel a little bit better to express myself out to the world, maybe. So I know, even though I live in sort of an isolated environment here, but I know that we're all kind of in it together. We are all in it together. And and we might say, oh, well, I like hanging with animals more than people, but it's true, but for me, <laughs> but I also know that I, I look for signs from animals to give me answers, but people have got some cool things to say about it as well. So maybe that's why I put this out. Good night, y'all.